Hi, and welcome to Flute 103, How to Produce a Sound. We're going to start by buzzing, just like the trumpets do. To do this, we place our lips flat together, nice and even. And we blow a very small, concentrated stream of air between our lips. If our lips are not even, if my lower lip is too far out, it makes a very uncontrolled stream of air. If my lower lip is too far, or my upper lip is too far out, it can create a very weak, misdirected stream of air. We want the lips to be flat and even, with only the very smallest amount of air getting through, but it should still be very focused and forceful air. You should be able to feel that air on your hand if it's about six to eight inches away from your face. After we've got the hang of buzzing, we're ready for the head joint. To place the head joint on your face, we look directly at the embouchure hole. We're gonna call this the kiss and roll technique. Looking directly into the embouchure hole, I place both of my lips right on top of the hole, kissing it. After I've done that, I'm gonna roll the head joint away from myself until I feel this tiny little edge against my lower lip. Take your index finger and rub the edge, the ridge of your lip, the part where the lip changes color from lip to chin. Go ahead and give it a little rub to wake those nerves up. This is the part that you're going to be feeling this edge with. Again, looking in my embouchure hole, placing it on both lips, and rolling it away from myself. Now I can barely feel the lip edge right on the edge of the embouchure hole, and I'm ready to blow. It works exactly the same way as buzzing, but we don't allow our lips to vibrate. Watch. This is the sound we should get. It should be a strong, continuous sound. If my embouchure hole is too big, I get a very unfocused, short sound. If it's too small, we can't get enough air through. It should be a strong, present sound. After we've got the hang, of placing the flute on our face and making this sound consistently, now it's time to connect the body of the flute and try it with the entire instrument. Using my correct hand position from the previous video, place the lip, same kiss and roll technique, and that's the sound we should get.